Hello students. In this video, we will be learning one mark questions under the topic coordinate geometry. The first question is the distance between the points x1, y1 and x2, y2 is dash. So now here we have to use the distance formula which is given by square root of x1 minus x2 the whole square plus y1 minus y2 the whole square and this is the distance formula units now this can also be x2 minus x1 the whole square and y2 minus y1 the whole square uh, because uh, anyway we are having the square of it so either way we can write it so this is the answer the next question is the distance between the points 0, 5 and 12, 0 is dash. So first of all we have to use this formula where we have to take this coordinate as x1, y1 and this coordinate as x2, y2. And then we have to substitute in this formula. And so the distance between these two points will be equal to square root of x1 is 0 minus 12 x2 is 12 the whole squared plus y1 is 5 minus y2 is 0 the whole square and so this will be equal to square root of negative 12 the whole square plus 5 square and that's equal to square root of negative sign if we square it will become positive and the square of 12 is 144 plus the square of 5 is 25 and so this will be equal to square root of 169 and this 169 can be written as 13 square and the square root and square gets cancelled and so we get it to be 13 units so therefore the distance between the points 0 comma 5 and 12 comma 0 is 13 units so this is the answer the next question is the midpoint of the line segment joining 4 comma 1 and negative 2 comma 3 is dash. So we have to find the midpoint of the line segment that joins these two points. So what is the midpoint formula? So first we shall write the formula. So the midpoint is given by x1 plus x2 divided by 2 comma y1 plus y2 divided by 2. So this is the midpoint formula. Now here this has to be taken as x1, y1 and this is x2, y2. And so when we substitute those values in this formula, we get it to be 4 plus x2. x2 is what? Minus 2. So it will be 4 minus 2 divided by 2, comma y1 is 1 and y2 is 3. So 1 plus 3 the whole divided by 2. And so that will be equal to 4 minus 2 is 2 divided by 2, comma 3 plus 1 is 4 divided by 2 and so therefore the midpoint will be equal to 1 comma 2 so this is the answer so here the answer will be comma 2 the next question is if three points a b c lie on the same straight line then the area of the triangle a b c is dash we know that if three points are collinear they, the area of the triangle is equal to 0. So here they say that the three points ABC lie on the same straight line which means this, that, that these three points are collinear and hence the area of the triangle will be equal to 0. So this is the answer. The next question is if the midpoint of the line joining the points 2 comma 5 and a comma b is 6 comma 6 then the value of a minus b is equal to what now here the two given points are 2 comma 5 and a comma b and the midpoint of the line segment joining these two points is given to be 6 comma 6 which means that by using the midpoint formula if we take this to be x1 y1 and if this is x2 y2 so it will be x1 plus x2 divided by 2 so 2 plus a divided by 2 comma 5 plus b divided by 2 will be equal to 6 comma 6 and so from this what do we obtain uh, 2 plus a to be equal by divided by 2 to be equal to 6 and from this we get that 2 plus a is equal to 12 and so the value of a is equal to 12 minus 2 which is 10 so this is the value of a 
and so we have the next to be 5 plus b divided by 2 to be equal to 6 and so 5 plus b will be equal to 12 and so the value of b will be equal to 12 minus 5 which is 7 and so the value of a is 10 and b is 7 and here they are asking us a minus b which is which will be 10 minus 7 and so the answer will be 3. So these are the one mark questions under the topic coordinate geometry. Hope you have understood it. We will continue this series in our next video. Thank you.